Capricorns, welcome to your reading, guys. Let's jump into a conversation with your person. Let's find out what's on their heart and mind when it comes to you and your connection. Let's jump in. Let's see whose energy is coming in strongest for my Capricorns this week. Y'all know all my readings are meant to bring you confirmations of the things you already intuitively and instinctively know about your person and your connection. If it doesn't happen with this reading, you can check out your other sign positions. I also do the extra wild card reading. Check that one out. See if I was able to pick up energy there. See what's going on, my Capricorn's person. Strongest energy forward, please. Where's our focus at? What is going on? Pop. Ooh, guys, the letter. The letter. Ooh. Either somebody's worried about getting a letter or a message from us that think they're John letter. So bad. The John is so bad. Or they're contemplating just a message to us. Oh, no, 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 no. We got the clock and waiting to get the letter to get an answer to something. So some somebody more than likely is sitting in anticipating that you're getting ready to break off with them. Mm-hmm. Ooh, let's jump in. Let's find out a little bit more. Let's make sure. Because I keep picking up I'm get, I'm getting two different two different things coming in. And we got to decide on one here. So yes. Cause like I said, somebody's anticipating an answer they're in a lot of frustration waiting 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 yeah uh that could be like just just an answer from you on something or they may be uh fearing that you're getting ready to break off with them hmm, wanting to hear from you also guys i'm picking up a lot let's jump in let's get this person talking so maybe we want more than one talk try and talk at us just get the strongest one forward. Pop. Got four imps. Four wands energy hitting a milestone. Ooh. <laughs> Respect, honor, ceremony. Hang on. Queen of wands. Divine feminine Aries energy coming in on that one. Ooh, and I see in the imp give, trying to give her the, the sunflower. And somebody's feeling stuck and hung and confused right now, trying to see things in a different perspective. Hmm. Somebody's waiting for an answer of hitting that milestone of stepping in and into something that's more of a committed relationship. Uh, with this one, uh, they're they're trying to win us over with that one. Uh, we're the big influence right now. They're waiting, waiting, waiting to see where our energy's going. If we're up for that, uh, four of wands kind of thing. Y'all know that sometimes that's a rehearsal to your wedding. How coming in on that queen of wands, we got on uh, the wheel. Ooh, guys, the wheel of fortune, karma. But pattern, the wheel's coming back around again. Hang on, let's see what they're talking about here. Ooh, rest, recovery, recuperation, getting clarity. Oh, the, uh, this also a break, taking a break. Mm -hmm. What else? Tell me more about that queen. What's she doing? The sun card. Do. Ooh, finding happiness, but also uh, revealing, revealing the answer. So they are waiting. Waiting to see uh, if we're going to come back around and reveal the answer to them. Hangman energy. Let's come in with that. I feel stuck trying to see things in a different perspective. We've got somebody that's emotionally vulnerable. Page up. Ghost or cups. Wanting to offer their heart, but standing there going, oh God, what's going to happen? Then we got a queen of pentacles. There you are, Capricorn. They're offering their heart to my Capricorns. Ooh. And a ten of pumpkins, they want something long term. They may have proposed and be waiting for you. It's something that will have heavy duty commitment to it. They're waiting for an answer from you because it seems to be. They seem to be saying you took a break. <laughs> to uh, and they're waiting for you to reveal it. Let's let's come in on the four imps real quick. Four imps. 
Oh, Page of Pumpkins, the babe. Page of Pentacles. Stand still energy. Somebody is uh, considering things from every perspective and they're not getting into the arena just yet. How many are we getting? I'm taking them because I've got them both. We've got a Ten of Cups energy or Ten of Ghosts with the Eight of Imps. Things are moving fast. Wow, somebody's at standstill because, yeah, and that eight of imps is eight of wands. That, that's another indication that this person is wanting to step up game with us to, to go to higher levels of commitment uh, in this connection. That heaven on earth. Ooh, but the babe is like, I'm not sure about that. Let me, let me think about it. Let me think about it. Ooh, let's pull these up. I'm going to leave out the opening cards to help cue me in so we can keep a full, as much of a full deck as I can get here. Mm. We already know their desires. They're desiring an answer. <laughs> yes. Oh. I'm going to ask them what they think your desire is. Capricorn? Let's try that. Let's turn let's turn the energy on. Let's see what they think your desire is in this connection towards them. Judgment card. Hang on. Let's see what else? Ten of imps, a ten of wands. Judgment is too hard. Too much pressure. Too heavy on me. And justice. Ow. Oh, tell me about justice. Justice. Keep going. Ooh, seven of imps, seven of wands, protecting yourself, but also in our Halloween tarot, guys, that little imp is not fitting in. He's standing out. And then we've got a page of bats, the page of swords, subconscious messenger. So this person really feels like on a subconscious level, mm, what just flipped out? King of imps, Leo energy. This person does feel like on a subconscious level uh, where you're taking a break, you're taking your time, you're, you're putting things in a standstill. This person feels like um, you don't feel like it's right. You don't feel like it's right. Mm -hmm. With this King of Imps coming out, that Leo energy, they, they're, they're not willing to give up yet. Mm -mm. Not yet, anyway. Mm -mm. Holding out hope. Bottom of the deck, magician holding out hope to manifest what they want. Uh, with our king of imps or king of wands energy, he goes after what he wants and he won't stop till he gets it. So, guys, yeah. But from their perspective, they're, they're feeling more hopeless uh, that you're getting ready to reveal a truth to them that it's off balance. It's not a good connection. That it's just not a fit either. I think I think they're representing themselves with a a feel like the man out, yeah. And it's, it's subconscious triggers, fear based, uh, monkey, ego brain chatter stories coming in, fighting the wind, fighting the wind. Ooh, let's see what their in, intentions are. What flew out, guys? Seven of ghosts, seven of cups. Guys, before it flew out, I was going to tell us. We're going to see what their intentions are, what they got strategizing in their brain right now. Uh, even though it's intentions, actions towards you and your connection, uh, if we get a plan of action, it, they may not take action on it, guys. How many times have you planned something and then not did it? Next one. Ew, guys, look. King of Imps again. Mm -hmm. Come out. Leo, King of Wands. What else? Well, tell us what you're doing. High Priestess. Ooh, Ace Imps. Ooh, guys, we got a direct plan. <laughs> Ow! Guys, with this one, just the fact that he's sitting here looking at the, the Seven of Cups, they're overwhelmed by their emotions right now and not sure what to do. But then we get a quick what's hidden in there in that in that deeper file. Uh, our high priestess, she reveals the hidden knowledge to us, the things we keep down. 
uh, Ace of Imps. Yeah, they would really like to win you over with a physical. Would that help? <laughs> like, oh, if we had some adventures in the bedroom, you think? A booty call? Would that help you make up your mind? I'm sorry, guys, but that is that that is a direct uh, thought that they're having down deep. But at the same time, the surface level of what corrects them, of you, st you need to quit thinking like that. Is I don't know what to do. I'm overwhelmed. So yeah, but don't be surprised if they, you know, call you up. Like you want, you wanna. <laughs> Oh, let's get on talking, guys. Let's see what deck they want to use. It's for my Capricorns. It's for my Capricorns. Talk to us. What's this? Oh, you're getting the roses. The light side of the rose deck. We'll take it. My Capricorns. My Capricorns. Let's get the energy. Pop. This one's trying to come out before we set the energy on it. Ooh, right there. And we got another one flying out. Talk to us. Pop. Ooh, we got some. You bring me to my knees. I never thought I could feel this way for anyone. I feel like you are so out of my reach. Too far away from me right now. I would give anything if I could just hold you. No. I act like I don't care, but I really do. I, oh, I'm hearing I act like it doesn't bother me, but it really does. Somehow, I will make the impossible possible. You mean everything to me. I wish things were simpler. I'm hoping and praying. Guarded. I'm hearing it like there's a question mark on it. Like they're trying to ask you a question. I want to be the one that gives you everything you need. Nothing compares to you. I'm not sure how you really feel about me. I don't mean to be so selfish. You're all I've ever wanted. And last one, guys. I melt every time I see your smile. Are they looking at your pictures? Guys, mm. hold the energy on the deck. Let's get them to focus their energy onto the deck. They want to give you a final and closing message from this week. It's my Capricorns. My Capricorns. You are getting the butterflies. The light side of the blue butterflies. Person, there's your please from the spot right there. Talk to us, pop. Wait for me. That could be I'm waiting for you. Mm -hmm. I can't get you off my mind. I need you. I never expected to meet someone like you. Social media, use your intuition, may not be for all of us. I have no clue what they're saying with that one, y'all. I don't want this to end. Do you think of me? You're my obsession. I can't quit thinking of you. I dream of a future with you. I've been through so much, I don't know if I can start over again. I'm trying to trust that we will be together. I pretend like I'm not, but I'm so jealous over you. And last one, guys. Oh, I don't want to see you with anyone else. Ow, oh, somebody is worried, worried, worried on that one. Hold the energy. Guys, let's use our Angel Answer deck. 
See if I can tap into your higher self. This is for my Capricorns. We're also asking your spirit guides and your guardians to come through for you on this. If you want to think of something you need an answer to, I'm going to try to get out two to three cards or however many it wants to come out. See what kind of answers if you want to focus in on what it is you need to answer for. It's for my Capricorns. Let's go for it. My Capricorns, whatever they need right now. Ooh, that one's wanting to stick out. Improving health. Think holistically. Mind, body, and spirit. What else? Abundance. 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 Improving health. Abundance. What else? For my Capricorns. Don't stop. Don't stop. Reconsider. Reconsider. There's something better that's coming in on abundance. And y'all got a lot here, her guys. I'm going to just keep pulling them. Ask your angels. Don't stop. Ask your angels. Improving health, reconsider within the next few weeks. Abundance, there's something better. No, no. Ask your angels and trust, trust. Capricorn says, all I have for us, guys, I'm sending you love and light. Many, many blessings as always. Thank you so much for visiting my channel. I hope I'll see you again next time. Bless be.